That's done. Did that. Check. Stop. And challenges to overcome. Puzzles to solve. Your team ship will give you access to new locations to explore. Guard it with your life. Solve the rails puzzle to find your very own Pacific Run data chip. Time for our teams to build up some steam. And we're off. Pay close attention to how many of each arrangement must be made. Teams must fill containers to match the arrangement shown in the display. Winner take all. Nancy versus Kiri. It's sudden death. Go. Get set. Are you ready? The team who finishes with the most points wins. Get it wrong five times and you get zero points for the round. Each player has five tries to get each round right. Because every time an incorrect container exits the assembly line or you use the reset button, you'll lose 10 points, where they will sit among sheep and reflect on their elimination until the competition comes to a close. Team Matata was not so lucky and will be rowing the kayak of shame out to lose her atoll. So Team Tui, enjoy the good luck. And Sunny June, don't make us come down there, young man. Location producer Sunny June has decided to bend the rules for Team Tui, sparing them some elimination. In a surprise twist, by which I mean surprising to those of us who should be running the show, while her partner continues to hold down a big old Brock, the brain from abroad easily holds down victory. Team Kia has returned the first medallion. Remaining teams still have a chance to place their medallions for second place. Another exciting round comes to a close on Pacific Run, New Zealand and must now flock to the shameful shores of Loser Atoll, who have been shorn from the competition, except teams Kakoa and Korea Ria. Congratulations, Team Kia! Remaining teams still have a chance to place their medallions for second place. But even if not one contestant located a single sheep, they say it's a poor shepherd who blames his sheep. Now on Pacific Run, New Zealand. Pacific Run, New Zealand! Well, let's hope it doesn't come to that, and we continue... Let's hear what she's got to say for herself. Say hello to our newest contestant, Bess Marvin. And hopefully not feeling too litigious. Luckily for Miss Fane and our lawyers, she's resting comfortably from this season's cast. Today, a dark mood hangs over New Zealand as the remaining contestants grapple with the loss of such a brave young woman. The world watched in stunned horror as tragedy struck George Fane. Last time on Pacific Run and Cocoa, it atolls for hee hee. Ask not for whom the loser atolls, which is exactly what two more teams discover as they learn to, but she's one woman you don't want to mess with. She may be just one woman. Kiri has placed her medallion first. If you're just tuning in, you've missed a stunning solo victory. You're watching Pacific Run. Team, I swear we didn't do anything. Amora Cora has been eliminated for cheating. And in another told-you-so case of cheaters never win, but after this, their spirits must be broken. They were just beaten by Bess Marvin's team. The other contestants can still work for second place. Team Tui has actually won a stage. But this stage delivers on the what? Like none before. This season has been full of surprises. You're watching Pacific Run New Zealand. It's the end of the road for Team Kiwi. Points for creativity, but elimination for cheating. After they were caught on camera trying to counterfeit their own medallions. Stub. Push! Okay. Oh, it's, uh, down there. Yeah. I've got some good news and I've got some bad news. Stop. I'm such an idiot. How long has he been down there? Is he walking? That is not swimming. That is not swimming. Those stories he told me. That's where Sonny was born. Is it okay that I wanted it to be true? I'm not stupid. That's what I made myself believe. That I wasn't just some kid. I was one of the Anunnaki, but he told me that him and me were special. Um, this is why I brought you along. I'm sorry I wrecked your life. Let your friend get hurt. I'm sorry, Nancy. There's nothing here, Jin! There's nothing here. Be careful. I think we only get one shot. Here's the final piece of the relic. Well, Nancy, this is why I brought you along. This is what Jin sent you to find? What is it? Sorry I doubted you, Grandpa Jin. Report to field! Team Tui! I'm taking over the airwaves! All crew alert! Emergency! That explains the photo edit she made of me holding a puppy. Sorta. It sorta explains that. She left out a lot of words. She did seem a bit frazzled. Oh! Wait, all she told you was literally just turtle? Maybe you should ask Patrick that. 
Um, what? Check your phone for a very special update from the show. Great, now get turtling. Your side quest is to discover the mysterious inner life of the Leatherback. I see why you care about her, and of course I'll be nice. She's a terrible messenger, though. Bess is adorable, and she adores you. No, because you're holding a ticket to the mothership of truth. Exactly, Sleuth. Okay, Sleuth, tell me more. You'll see. I can make you a badge if you want. Surprises, like this one. Surprise, your life is dangerous now. Yeah, that's like issue one on the list of things to fix, though. But you're in luck. You've already been a member for a few years. You're the only contestant who doesn't only ask me about points. Anyway, his name's Jin. He's an explorer, the founder of Spide. Sleuth is such a weird word. My grandfather. Odd works. Mysterious. Hmm. Well, right now, I'm seeing you. And then I forget the whole thing. But then hilarious. Is it? I think it's scary. Me. The main producer plane was diverted, and their passport paperwork was filed incorrectly. That's true. I was a little overconfident in my knowledge of airport codes. Possibly. Maybe. Great! Grab a rope and join me in the caves! You're finally ready for that answer I promised you? Yeah, this job isn't going on my resume. That's up to the embassy now. Nancy, that makes me very happy for you. Earth weddings are great. Surely you believe an old man dancing, though. Or an old man busting loose at a wedding reception. Well, fate moves in odd ways. Like a spider. Is that so? Good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Did it land? Where will be the last truth you hear? We will have won. When the time comes to know the truth, you'll know. Trust me, it isn't yet. No. But think, is this the once? Yes. Should I float the boots? I won't. Aside from this awesome belt I had made? It is not going well. Yep. You're interesting. Other people say smudgy? I think the line between something existing and something waiting to be found is smudgy in your case. No, I am. Because they're uh, fascinating and full of mystery. Whatever you do, don't read my papers. Have you been reading my papers? Go beat Kiri. You'll see. I was hoping you'd take point on the helping, and I'd focus on the getting help. This is not the one you want. You asked for one straight answer, and I agreed. I wasn't prepared to lie. I don't do my best work under pressure. It's for my science fair. I know. Nope. You're just afraid I'll win. Are we saying it together, or is this a competition to see who can say it better? I didn't leave that name just lying around for you to trip on. You're reading my things. But some things I might have to send you when you're not next to me. I need your help. I wanted you to read it. All things forgotten, never known, odd, and Jamila demands proper archaeology. You could add what you'd like to. Ah, no, you won't. But behind the teaching at Spide, we're doing some interesting research. There's a position for you, too, if you'd ever like to join in. Of course. Oh, no, not Jamila! Tell her I say hi, though! Tell her I say hi. I won't. I could. I know. You and me, maybe. Humans in general, maybe. But we're losing so many species so fast. It's not their fault we're here. Aliens are here. We're all aliens. Earth life started with bacteria on asteroids. In a way, we're all space mutts. Because he's different. But everyone else just seems embarrassed by him. A lot of the family won't use her last name. Oh yeah, he's sort of my hero. No. Yes. The footage was, uh, destroyed. Not in a fire, but in a magnetic thing. But so is never reaching out toward the fantastic. Hey you. Hi. Nancy Drew. Just like it's yours. It was her choice to play. She's got a temper. What's it mean? What's that sound I'm making? Take a word and say it 50 times in a row, and at some point you'll be like, well, in reality, everything's crazy. Hmm. Crazier things have happened. I'm not like one of those Area 51 types. But why not? So, in closing, all y'all animals and mountains equally unlikely and insane. If the word exists, then what's the point of me repeating them? Why did I borrow this one? Why don't I speak my own language? Very much. I do. Do you like comics? I've got something for you. Wouldn't that be cool? Yeah. The good ones teach us so much about ourselves. And the best part is I totally know what you meant. Wait, nope. That's the opposite of what a cast should do. And it would have speakers and moving parts. If I picked the cast, it would have been a little bit more colorful. See ya. Cool, cool. Bye. Hmm. I should double check. Do you know how far broadcast signals can travel in space? I'm not. No clue!
Only one. Just one. Okay. Hi, it's me. I never check these. Text or email. Thanks. I don't know anything about her. Look at what she's good at. Look at Sunny's notes in the comic. This I know. She's a linguist and a code breaker. Sunny wants her in case he actually finds something. Or the person who finds the answers. Right before we met. I imagine that's when his plan started. He kept saying that. Bring him to me. He's the last one. Sunny nearly punched a hole in the sky. He was so excited. I thought it was pretty funny, so I told Sunny about him. Apparently, right? But he said he felt the world pulling him in another direction. Sunny wanted all of you to stay through the competition because you all have a certain skill. They raised him to join them in their teaching. Not really odd. It turns out his parents are these gurus of sort, and he'd follow it where it led. But soon he'd find it again. He told me that he had just lost his river. I asked him if he was worried about being lost. I'm lost in the desert. Isn't that funny? Naturally, that's what I asked. You know what he said? I found him lost in the desert. He and his team were there for a playoff game of sorts. We met back when I was in the Order. He's my inclusion. Accidentally. Indeed. For the actual learning that goes on behind the scenes. Most places that teach are a cover. It's a cover. Yes, although, between you and me, the lessons are all rubbish. I suppose I do, unofficially. Someday you should meet everyone. You'd fit right in. I specialize in artifacts, as does Sunny. We each have our interests. But when they leave, that's when the interesting work begins. I feel bad for the students. We just make things up about aliens while they take notes or nod off. Of course. Jin believes if we assemble all the relics hidden by the testers, that's what he calls them, everyone else will find their pieces their own way. You're finding pieces that are hidden like clues, no doubt. They're hidden in different ways. Because they're not just hidden. Yes. No, but then again, the pieces are there, and he's finding them. Then we pass the test and they'll come visit again. Remember, Sunny wants you to act as you are, not as you could be. Maybe. That was your test. Yes, he brought you in as well. He's the one who gave me the tip about the final dig site. All of you are. Look at the comic. Look at the people around you. You're an instrument. He's building his orchestra. He's not hoping you suddenly become a more special version of yourself. It means that he's studied you. He wants you to act as you are. So he says. Jin believes we were visited before each new advancement, and given a lesson to perfect. And then from that point on, we developed newer and more powerful technologies. But also a great deal of bashing each other about the head. And then that led to agriculture. We did a great deal of sitting about at first, until the first tool was invented. He believes that each major development in humanity is a lesson. That we each have a lesson to perfect. That's the goal, to find your own song and play it perfectly. He believes each life is like that too. We got to talking about antiquities. I felt bad for the guy. Took him out to lunch. He thought I knew something he didn't. He was heartbroken when I explained I didn't actually believe in aliens. I'd been talking about the Anunnaki quite a bit. He was very excited to talk to me about it. Somehow he already knew my name. Back when I was in Egypt the first time, he found me. It did. A few years later, I joined Spied. He gave me a map and said, Call me if this leads somewhere good. Then, after a solid fifteen minutes of convincing him that writing his name on the Sphinx was a terrible idea, otherwise he'll know I helped. I remember both, but if you're going to snoop on Sonny, you'd better be able to explain how you solved that. Then divide by the number of the chapter on testers, and the number of stars that look like a hat. Take the number from the UFO, the sum of the constellation pamphlet numbers, otherwise he'll know I helped. I remember both. But if you're going to snoop on Sonny, you'd better be able to explain how you solved it. The number from the UFO he's drawn in Chapter 6, and the chapter reference in Chapter 5. Take the number in Chapter 2, the lower number of the Constellation pamphlet, which I happened to edit just the other day, so he hides the codes he needs in the spy booklets we put together. He never remembers those things, and he tells Sonny these stories. Jin comes to be there for the family. Really bad. He's in bed for forever. Then one day... Sunny gets sick. She didn't want him around Sunny when he was younger. Didn't want him to get hurt by Jin suddenly taking off. And it seems that his daughter, Sunny's mum, felt a little left behind. Jin has spent his life chasing after these big adventures. Well, you'll need to ask him. Until one day, on a whim, he visits one of the locations from the comic. He does. But they were just stories. Sunny's mum tells him that his grandfather's stories were nice. Sunny gets better. Jin moves on. For that year, they're the best of friends. Gives him these comics he drew for him. But I hope not. He could. Not. I hope not. That's in anticipation of your next question. 
he trusts me to not trust him. Sonny and I still work together quite a bit. Yes, he did. I told him not to. Fair point. He said he'd already put the gears in motion as the story demands. That's what I asked. He was on the other end of the phone, just dead quiet. He stopped talking. And that's when things ended up in the frightening territory. Of course. Maybe even die. Something where people could get hurt. He said he was going to do something there was no turning back from. He was talking a mile a minute. Off the record? But the night before he left, he called me. He won't say. He's here on his grandfather's orders. He doesn't know if he trusts his grandfather. Yeah, what indeed? Sonny doesn't know if he's lost it. More concerning, though, I don't know if Sonny's finally lost it. Well, here's some more pressure. Nancy, I owe you my loyalty. I know you can keep calm under pressure. Mine too. I don't know if I believe exactly what he believes in, but I do believe he believes it, and I believe in him. I don't know how to explain it. That's the one. I'm not sure what he's after. I believe it's an artifact. He's trying to follow up on his grandfather's wishes. Well, yes and no. That you do. I hope it's enough. Jin found it spied. He's hard to track down, but he's an expert on relics and ancient sites. And aliens. Something his grandfather, Jin, was desperate to get his hands on. That's all I know. Something very important to the Anunnaki. Hold on. Where are you calling from? That's right. Oh, I remember you. Nancy who? Who is this? I'm glad you're doing okay. At least until now. Be less certain about that. Are you in any immediate danger? So Sonny found you. What's it mean, right? If you know the word, then you know the story. I'm so sorry to not include you, but it's not my call. Never mind. I'll change it by the time we're off this call. Already done. What did you find out? So you know the spied passphrase. That's all Sonny wants, in his own way. But it's time for humanity to grow up before we wreck everything. Because I may not believe we're being watched, and frankly I don't care, why belong to Spide? Aliens, space worms, giant monsters and lab coats, I don't care. Jin calls them the testers. Supposedly we're being watched by advanced beings. We need to learn to perfect, to demonstrate. Each life is a lesson. Each stage of human development is a lesson. Evolving. No, advancing. Because that's what the Anunnaki are all about. It's a teaching tool, usually for piano players, but Jin liked the idea that a lesson could exist as art. That's not how people answer questions. Yes, but he told me stories. Of course I did. Problem was that the answers were very confusing. Please, Nancy. Wouldn't I like to know? His grandfather. It didn't make any sense, Nancy. I'm so sorry. Hi. Nancy? Hello? Because it's true. The Earth is in a very bad way right now. Less fun. Spy believes that there is a community like the United Nations, but instead of countries, it's planets. Galaxies. It's easy, but it's crazy. Watch what I do and you'll see your answer. Don't push me to say. No, it doesn't. Not if pretending it's true makes the world better. Doesn't matter if any of this is real. Be realistic. Exactly. But do us both a favor. But. Yes, there is. But we don't know how to work together. We adapt. We're strong. We're smart. We have everything we need, right? As was I. We need help. We can't go it alone. The deck was stacked in your favor. No offense, but it's not shocking who is left over. Did you see all the rest of the competition? I know what Sonny's up to. Listen, this is important. See what happens. When he does, tell him Jamila says hi. Ask him. He'll laugh it off. I don't know if you remember, but a long time ago we talked about the Anunnaki. Sonny thinks these comics are like maps, clues he needs to follow. Sonny's grandfather drew these books for him. There was something to entertain him when he was sick. Of course, pieces. Good. That confirms things. You found a comic, haven't you? Talk to you when I can. Be safe, Nancy. Bye. No disrespect to space. I just like to be a bit more grounded. I'm starting a subset of Spide for discovering the wonders actually on the planet. I'm pleased to report yes, thanks to you. But there is still a lot of work to be done. Not at the moment. I'm back home in London. Hey, George here. Can't pick up the phone. Leave it at the beep. Let's split up and look for all the plants we need. Let's just focus on the first task. Nancy, what's up? If you want to talk, sneak into the medical tent in the producer area. If we live. Six months. For the next year, we do whatever Bess wants. And now it's like her own personal nightmare. Poor Bess. It was so sweet of her to set this up. But we take it seriously. Movies, magazine time, listening... Let's both study up. The rules are in the tent. 
Lena seems to be pretty obsessed with the rules. Go check them out. There are new confessionals. No promises. Yeah. I'm gonna trip her back. Does it matter? I think Kiri just tripped me. Sorry, I'm just still having trouble staying awake. Check the tablet. I got some news on Kiri. I'll take his word for it. Well, now I need to know. Uh, why? Bottom corner's blue. Tell Sunny, top corner's green. You'll find an odd device in one of the caves. Nancy! I figured out Sunny's blueprints! Good luck. George here. What's up? Hey there. Ah! These casts are the worst! Speaking of, it's a head-scratcher. It could be an alien trap for all I know. Slow and unsteady. Here's a tip. Don't fall off a bridge and land on your head. They're drawn together for a reason. It's fine. Think about it. These people are in the comic. They have different skills. I think it's a message. Like a map for Sunny. It seems like a homebrew affair. I've been thinking about the comic. Call Jamila. Something tells me she's involved. One of the prizes is a phone call to an expert. But you can. No. I think we should talk to her. Among other things. Remember Jamila? Nancy. The rules don't say what kind of expert. Gotta go! Call me later. Bye. Oh, you'll find out. Saying strange things to Sunny and then running away. Hanging out in the producer area, I think. Let's do a little extra. She worked really hard to get us on the show. Take care of her. Her Sunny infatuation is tipping from, Aw, that's cute, to, oh, this'll end in tears. I'm a bit worried about Bess. It's like he's trying to keep them occupied, out of the way. Sunny keeps sending the crew on these nonsense missions. You know what's weird? It's a profound thought. Can you write it down? But don't know we do the same thing because we don't really know what we're doing. How we all just do the same thing. Was just thinking about it. They just say it's smarter and have better memories. Sure you have. No, not like school. Teach? They're all very wise and accomplished. My family. They're all very different than me. How can anyone teach? There's too much to know. Or not want, maybe. I tried to understand it, but no luck. They teach people how to not exist. They belong to an order. Leave it to me. Someone needs to cheer her up. What's that? She called it a Bessestential crisis. Your friend Bess seems to be going through some sort of crisis. Or they're in a line. Or small birds. Big stone. Lena wants me to spy on you. It's like two birds in the bush. What? Oh, yeah, that too. Yeah? What? I thought he invited me. Oh, he makes lines, like an architect. Mmm, who? Let's just both listen. Uh, let's talk about something else. This conversation is confusing. Maybe he did? Oh, then I think I should sit this one out. No. Yes. Doesn't feel any different than regular life. It's like you make a tiny clone of yourself for people to yell at. I've been on TV before. You don't notice it when it's happening. And I said, should I pack? I suppose. Lean said, we're going to be on TV. Well, that's why we're here. I bet that's the book that Lean is obsessed with. I know, but have you ever thought about which book it means? What book? If you don't know but you care, that means I'm not supposed to say. I won't go in a real river. I can't swim. When you're in the river, it's not a real river. I was facing down the river. I played until I was really good. My mother told me when you were in a river, you do what it says. Okay. It's supposed to push you to your self-discovery. My parents' students worry if they're in the river. Ask Lena. I know, right? That place is hilarious. Have you been to the puzzle place? But that's what people always do with ideas they think are dangerous. Ideas aren't dangerous until you try to bottle them up. It's just ideas. I never thought to ask. That's a profound thought. Please write it down. Yeah, I'm good at that. Oh, like harmonious opposites? What? Rugby is a sport. I don't like competition. That I'm here? Yes. All these rules. Too many rules. This is silly. A lot of bees. If that's true, infatuation is love plus bees. My parents teach that love is calm and understanding. My face has been on cereal boxes, so I have been the subject of infatuation. She isn't. Your friend Bess thinks she's in love with Sunny. It's great. Yeah, what? You know they say bees communicate by dancing? Maybe we should just go back to the drawing board. Who invented the minute anyway? I don't know. I'm not the best with time. So it looks like we're talking. So usually I share crackers. People like to talk even when I don't know what to say. I don't have any crackers. I know. I trust most people. But we're not. It's, it's all zebras. That's important. A group. Okay. The zebra's standing in a pack. A herd? Pride? Collective. The zebra's standing in a pack. Want to hear a joke?
God, I thought that was just me. Thanks. And this other zebra goes, oh no, that's my plan too. And one zebra says, I'm hiding in plain sight. Sorry. I'm serious. I made a promise. I really can't talk to you anymore. Well, someone told me they can't. Can gorillas swim? I'll just sink to the bottom. I don't have any body fat. I'm like a gorilla. Lena wanted me to kayak. I hate water. Who would make up something like that? They all seem to know stuff. I never fit in. And you wouldn't fit in with my family. Why? But I retired. And I was once the top rugby player in the country. Uh, yeah, don't try it though. It's a family trait. I can hold my breath for three minutes. Hmm? That's, that's what I mean. Now, see? Oh, wait. What? Say what? Why are you always trying to distract me? Uh, what? Hi. Hmm. Nice talking to you. Talk to you another time. Goodbye. Nope. Oh. Lean, who am I supposed to say I saw? Oh, hey, Lena says I'm supposed to say that there was someone else near the bridge. No, just us. Lena? Near the bridge? With Lena? I'm pending. A dud or something. There's not much there. Figure me out. She just doesn't think so. She did. A feeling, I guess. Your friend was trying to figure me out. It must have been important. It came across loud. There was some reason. I'm not supposed to be talking to you anymore. That means I'm going to get in an argument later. Oh. She was back there too. Lena saw you sneaking into the off-limits area. Exactly. That's good too. Write it down. Most athletes are. People say that to me. Well, just a little. But believing in aliens seems more involved. Well, I've seen aliens. Hmm. Why not? That's what my dad always says. I don't know. Maybe I can't skate by on fun alone. Maybe this is a wake-up call. I can't catch a break. Nothing's coming up, Bess. I really don't know. Yeah, maybe he's right. You've reached Bess. Please leave your message in the form of a compliment. And how he can be so calm in any storm. I was talking to Patrick about Sunny and you and... Okay, then. No, still. Do you think we'll ever stop doing stuff like this? And at this point, he gave me a cracker, but I don't have any, so... Ask. What's the question you want to ask about Sunny? It is. Maybe you should try it, but he said it in that profound, cowish way. He told me to think of the question I wanted to ask, and then ask it. Not being eaten by bugs, friends, a roof over my head. I don't ask for much in this life, Nancy. That would be the nature of this call, yes. You can't see me, and you'll never be able to catch me. Okay. No. I spent a lot of points. Microwave privileges. Nancy, don't be mad. Indoor plumbing. Toward the two of us owning a coffee shop slash bakery in Paris, I know. I have no idea. Beth is back. I said words with my mouth, and he understood them because they were in the right order. I talked to Sunny. I don't agree with myself either. What has gotten into Beth? And make galactic jazz or something. Yes, and they want to teach us how to be better. I have news. But no, like whales, of course, and horses and definitely bees. But we don't know it. That they're already here? He said something adorable about aliens. Wait! But let's not horse the cart here. I know. She wants you to look. She's keeping notes on the tablet he gave her. George isn't sure. Or at least review the schematics. He wants her to build a machine. I figured out what Sunny was bringing George. I made a tape. She's not a pretty snorer. I'm glad she seems to be doing better. That's all he said. Yeah, turtle. Turtle? Yeah, your extra event that gives us bonus points. Nancy. Sunny gave me her quest. She has left this conversation due to confusion. You've reached the voicemail for Bess Marvin. So now it's yours. No tagbacks. Well, I don't get it either. You were going to be on the show, anyhow, saying they'd made a mistake. But then a week later, I got a note from the producers. Yeah, your application for Pacific Run came back with a rejection letter. I didn't think much of it at the time. Nancy, can I tell you something weird now? Right. What if that was Sunny? At the time, I didn't find that weird. Deadly, get crushed, hard to reach. So the best I could understand was, then it got windy and the sheep started bleeding or whatever. I heard, Curie, here is your personal quest. Well, sort of. Well, I heard him giving Curie her quest. Again, I hope my quest is very pleasant. No joke. Good luck. Yeah, his team gets a bonus if he stands in a field. Did you know that's Patrick's job? Standing in a field? Um, zero things? I hope my quest involves sitting comfortably. If everyone gets special assignments, then when will we get ours? 
Me either. Until he solves whatever. I don't know. Hey, Nancy. What's up? Now to our correspondent in the field. Best Marvin Industries, makers of Best Marvins. To which Best Marvin may I direct your call? Nancy! Yeah, I got caught. I know the meaning. Define caught for me again. Is it weird that Sunny doesn't care we're breaking the rule about visiting George? She's okay. I'll keep looking into it. That's the best way these days, apparently. Maybe an accusation. Given my track record lately, probably just some sounds. Which is good, because I was about to say something really strange to him. Sunny looked the other way. See ya. Later. Bye. Talk about a world brimming with possibilities. I'm even happy to say the word anything. I'm happy to say anything. I'm happy to say that. You have no idea how much I love you right now. That would be best. It is merely the tip of the Rageberg. But I will walk without joy. I will walk on you. Sorry. Oh, I already lost. Yeah, for three hours. I have to take a vow of silence. I got my side quest. Well, I'm insulted, so I'm going to go make Patrick listen to my thoughts. Right, like Patrick does. Sonny said I needed to listen to my own thoughts. That was fun. Oh, w were you saying help? I'm okay. Yeah. Ah! Oh dear. Oh, hang on, I just... Ah, God, I can't... <sighs> Say that louder. Send what? Hey, you guys okay? Guys, you gotta come check this out. Never mind. Stairs. Is there a plan for getting me back up? <coughs> I'm fine. This is my river. I can't swim. I sink. Like a gorilla. That's it. Not sure what. Oh, what's this? I just need motivation. Lena seems to boss you around. Is that a fair assessment? He's motivated and built as solid as the rocks in the box that is likely referenced when describing his smarts. I think she still doesn't. She didn't want me to talk about it. Yeah, we were there. You want me to talk about the waterfall? This couldn't hurt. I've won a lot of things. You seem pretty driven to win. I'm running out of crackers. But she still overflows a bit, because I don't talk much. You'd think the two of us together would make up one conversation. That best girl likes to talk. Except for the part where she stole stuff from our tent. Oh, Nancy? Yeah, she seems nice. What? That's it. Oh, I'm supposed to talk about the other people. Generally, people talk about other contestants. I stole some food from the craft table. Oh, confessional booth, okay. This is where you share your darkest secrets. What do I do? All my first time on television. Not my first time in reality. This is my first time on reality television. I used to be a pro rugby player for New Zealand. Uh, this is the confession booth. My name is Patrick. And he's fallen asleep. But if I just sit here, how will I think of something? Just sit here until I think of something? I don't have anything to say. But technically, it's not against the rules. Oh, no, she absolutely stole the medallion. I don't think he was joking. I couldn't tell if he was joking. Sonny told me about his secret plan. With the aliens. Who would you like to call? Keep an eye out for extra missions. Sometimes the perks will be even better than the points. The first team to finish a stage gets the highest score. Second team gets the second highest and so on. Your rules are in your tent. Read the rules. The producer areas are off limits. Very off limits. When you get a medallion, bring it back to the stand. Keep an eye on your phone for updates from the announcer. Everyone has a game phone. Okay, I'm Sunny. I'm the line producer. Let's call that good. I have to go. You can still win coming in second or third once in a while. Whoa, you're not supposed to hear that. My plan requires many specific talents. Can't use my phone here. This is not the best place to make a call. Persephone, the life of spring. On Mount Olympus, it was decided Hades searched for a queen to sit beside his darkened throne. In ancient days of Greece long past, the labyrinth of lies. And escape from, join us on our next adventure. But the seeds of deception had already been sown. Demeter tried to save her daughter now belong to the night below. Ah! I'm not falling for that. So what's next? Any great ideas to get us out of this cave? Maybe it's time to let go of your grandfather's stories. How many more people get hurt for this mission? I'm going in if he's not up soon. Uh, Sonny? Yes, I never said you were. What about now? To solve this puzzle? 
All right, well, what do I do? What is this? Sunny, calm down. Stressed. You do know she's got a crush on you, yeah? Yes. Bess said my quest was turtle. What does turtle mean? Turtle. <laughs> wow, she left a lot of that out. Sometimes. Be nice to her. You're not going to make this easy on me, are you? Why are you calling me that? You need our skills. Those of us that remain, I think you're assembling a team. What happens when I find all of whatever it is you're looking for? So, what are the perks of membership? Are most of your members unaware of their membership? I bet Spied is one of those top-secret members-only clubs, right? Why did you call me a sleuth? What? Can you tell me a little about him? Where does the nickname Sonny come from? Downgrading to weird. So, I'll say you gave me an odd look. You know what I mean. Bess wants me to ask if you're seeing anyone right now. That's an interesting way of looking at things. And who was behind that? Well, what's the story? I heard a rumor that you're not supposed to be the one running the show. You want something from me, don't you? So, am I getting kicked off the show? Let's just say I'm beyond ready. Embassy? When will the rest of the production team arrive? I've been to a wedding, Sonny. I don't believe in fate. It is. Passable. I, uh, do you want pointers? Did you intend for that to be menacing? I was rejected from the show, and then a few weeks later added back to the roster. How? Yes. What are you doing with a show? Can you give me a straight answer just once? Yes, aside from the belt. Do you have any proof aliens exist? Is this your first time producing a TV show? You know a lot about me and everyone else here, it seems. <sighs> You're not the first to say that. Are you leaving the comics for me to find? You're sending me mixed messages here. Why not? No. And where does all this help lead? You're not being very helpful. Did you take my medallion? <laughs> that seems unlikely. What's the story with the machine you want George to build? Can you talk to me about that? Sonny, I read your grandfather's letter. Can you focus? Let's say I was. Tell me about Jin, your grandfather. With what? Why? About what? I'll consider it. You teach together at Spied? Are you and Jamila friends? I was expecting more of a reaction. Jamila says hi, by the way. Can you help me figure out what to do? Someone took our medallion. I know you're worried about the future of Earth. I think we'll be fine on our own. So why aliens? Huh, that's extreme. Why would they do that? So you were pretty close to your grandfather? Is it okay if I check? All of it? Can I see footage of the bridge collapse? Isn't hijacking a television show kind of a really terrible idea? It sounds like you had her attempt something very dangerous. Kiri seemed very upset with you. Crazier things than aliens existing? Do you believe in aliens? Do you? Was it some sort of message? Lena wanted me to show you this comic. Did you leave it for her to find? You're talking about George's cast. I think you're the one who picked this season's cast. Not exactly. Why are you here? You don't seem very concerned about the show. So what exactly do you do as a producer? I found your note. You need to give me one straight answer about what's going on here. Am I going to regret pulling this lever? Well, here goes. All right, I did it. What about Patrick? Kiri, what's she here for? And Lena? So I'm, what, the person with the questions? When was this? And the middle of a desert? He's really very calm. It's odd. Yeah, I can see him saying that. What? What do you mean by the deck being stacked in our favor? What was he doing? You did? Why? Any clue? A cover? For what? Well, then why teach? As a teacher? Do you work for Spied? What work? Can I call you back? What are they for? Well, why not find them himself? I keep finding relics. Is that what Sonny is looking for? Do you believe that? I passed, I presume. What? He did? So why do you trust Sonny so much? I don't know if I understand. That's the etude? What is Jin's obsession with etudes about? 
That must have been an odd conversation. How? How did you meet Sonny? You remember that, but not the combination? You wouldn't know the combination to Sonny's footlocker, would you? You remember that, but not the combination? You wouldn't know the combination to Sonny's footlocker, would you? Okay. What's the story with Sonny and his grandfather? What does he find? He doesn't believe that? And then? But he could have been? Hope? Do you think Sonny could be behind George's injury? Wait, you knew he was hijacking the show? And? Why was he so upset? Would anyone believe the record? And? You told him to stop, right? Something bad? To do what? What? More concerning than the show being led by a crazy person? Do you think it's true Sonny hijacked the crew of the show? That's what people say before introducing more pressure. That's a bit circular for my taste. About why you'd trust Sonny? What kind? Okay, what's the no? Give me the yes. Do you have any clue what Sonny's up to? I need your help. From Egypt. It's Nancy Drew. Close. Nancy. No. It would appear so, yeah. New Zealand? Aside from that. All right, beyond the passphrase, I just missed the boat on... Passphrase? Yeah. If you don't care, then... Aliens? Does the word etude mean anything to you? Demonstrate to whom? Becoming better piano players? I get that, but why does it keep coming up? I'm afraid that I don't. What were the stories about? Do you remember what he said? You didn't ask any follow-up questions? You said, as the story demands. What does that mean? That does seem to be the main talking point these days. So it's the UN, but more fun. Do your worst. So do you believe in spied or not? Yes, it does. Be nicer. Explain this whole Anunnaki thing to me. And the Galactic Parliament doesn't like this. I sense a... Uh, I'm pretty sure we can. Well, not really. How did Sonny know who would make it through the competition? What? Right. Why? Why do they matter now? What are they from? Pieces. So all is well with the order? Are you still hunting antiquities? All right, which part should I focus on? I'm not sure what to do next. Two months. Better. I agree. I know. Makes sense. Got any good advice? Maybe just focus on the task. A little. On purpose? Excellent. What is it? Says he'll sink to the bottom like a gorilla. Oh, it's Patrick. He's terrified of swimming. You know, maybe I don't need to know. Can gorillas swim? Looking at it, that seems unlikely. What could it be for? How's your progress with Sonny's machine? How's your head feeling? Right. Yeah? Can you hook me up with a phone line? I do. The alien expert. Interesting. What? What's Bess up to? I always do. Tell me about it. Me too. That is a little weird. Nope, I used to. I'm losing perspective these days. Okay, I guess you could say that. Why did you tell me that zebra joke? I've never met anyone who announces their profound thoughts so directly. I guess I don't understand. What subjects? What did they do? That doesn't make you a dud, just makes you different. You said you were a dud. Why? So the teaching didn't appeal to you? That's nice of you. I know. I just don't know how. It's an expression she made up. I know. It's not great. I think that's two birds with one stone. What's your angle? Both, then? Or is he here for selfish reasons? Do you think he's nice? What do you think of Sonny? He did, but maybe he has another less obvious reason? Can you think of any reason he'd want you here? The guy in charge? The line producer? Can you think of any reason Sonny would want you to be here? Okay, like what? So you think that's a possibility? You can't say both. Does it strike you as strange that there have been so many accidents here? You weren't excited. Are you excited to be on Pacific Run? What do you mean? She's obsessed with a book. Interesting. The rule book, I guess. It's an expression. I'm surprised you don't like rules. Lena seems to be very by the book. Okay, no one's gonna make you. What's that mean? Is that all? How did you get into professional rugby? Like destiny? How are you holding up in the rankings? What makes it hilarious? I have. 
Why? You're very vague about what your parents do. You and Lena seem to complement each other pretty well. Right, a competitive sport. Weren't you a pro rugby player? What's that? Do you think there's anything odd about this competition? I'll pass that along to Bess. What makes you the expert? Oh, yeah, I know. Yeah, I have no idea. How's that? How long have you and Lena been together? Crackers? I'm not sure what you're talking about. Me too. Do you think I should trust Kiri? I'm there. Hurt is okay with me. Sure. I don't get it. That's pretty good. Okay. Okay. I don't know. You can't swim? Why? I couldn't help overhear you fighting earlier. I'm just naturally a curious person. Can you tell me a little more about your family? Really? I guess I meant to ask if you had any special skills. Do you have an area of expertise about distracting you? What makes you say that? You were not supposed to say that. Who? Anyone else? Did you see anyone near the bridge? Where? Where were you when George was injured? Did what? What makes you say that? Why not? Oh, interesting. You're very honest. Is she going to tell on us? Not the ones I've heard of. You seem very humble. You don't fit the image I have of a professional athlete. You've seen aliens? Is this the first time you've thought about it? Do you believe in aliens? That's what all dads say. It's genetic. For what? Why do you think that is? George seems worried about you. So what do you want to do? Okay. Why do you ask? Me either. Do you want to? Sonny, what is going on in that crazy brain of yours? And that's good? Sounds simple. What did he say? Bess, come on. So the auction house got to you, huh? Are you the reason our score went down? Bess, could you stop? What was so important that you spent our points? Well, that's a step. What did you talk about? Okay, we don't agree on what's adorable. Are aliens? That's not adorable per se. Okay, what? I'm glad old Bess is back. Good work, Bess. Why? What was it? Me too. There has to be more than that. Turtle? What is it? My quest? Bess? There's got to be more to it than that. I don't get it. It did? Sure. Whoa. Okay. Really? Any more news on Sunny? Whatever it is sounds intense. For how long? Standing in a field? Why? What are you doing? Bess, what's going on? Soon, I hope. I don't get it. And? <sighs> Look it up. Did you get caught? How's George? That is odd. Like what? I'm happy to hear that. I won the bonus. Wow, okay. I'll try again. That's intense. Sorry, we didn't win the bonus. Oh, that's okay. Starting win. What? What is it? Good luck. Weird. Are you okay? You gotta be kidding me. Help! Help! Send help! Wait, Patrick! What? Well, it doesn't matter. It's too deep. No way we can get down there. What is it? Do you see something down in the water? Haven't done that. Can't check that off yet. Still have to do that. Oh, sounds intriguing. What kind? What do you do when you're not on TV? Worth a shot. Here's a card. I have a points card. Any chance you'd consider trading something else? Oh, yeah? What do I get for passing? Yeah? Want to team up? I think this might be his code. I was hoping you could shed some light on your connection to him. Have you met Jin, Sonny's grandfather? Really? You seem very smart. What made you decide to sign up for the show? Is it boring, or is it true that you weren't being honest about being a fan? What did he look like? Last name? Okay, your favorite competitor? What's your favorite season of Pacific Run? In case of a tie, there's a sudden death round. There's no such thing as a tiebreaker in this show. I took your advice and read the rules. Do you believe that? What was it about? What kind of book? Did you ever find out what Jin was looking for in the rare book room? You're kidding me. Yes, and that's the rule you broke. I thought you were the one who followed all the rules. You moved our medallion. 
Hang on, that's not what I meant. Do you think your need to figure out riddles is what drew you to Patrick? Are you toying with me? I'm not seeing it. I can see something there. You and Patrick are a very unique couple. How did you and Patrick get together? Two years, four months. Eight, no, four years. No. How long have you and Patrick been together? And he played in the orchestra? How did you meet Jin? He was using the orchestra as a cover? For what? Okay. Do you live in New Zealand? Do you think she might be right? She seems to be blaming Sonny. Did you hear about Kiri's accident in the mine? Is there such a thing? I skimmed. So that's a no? Did you take our medallion? I'll keep that in mind. I'm sensing that this is your main strategy. That feels a lot like cheating to me. I did. He's, uh, looking into it. You know, you won't get away with bending the rules forever. You're speaking as a competitor? Do you think it's a bad idea for me to pair with Kiri? She seems to know what she's doing, so I could do worse. I'm not sure where I stand on that. Can I trust you not to just run off with this? No, but I'm sure Bess could find one for me. I could make it worth your while. How about if I give you a points card? I found a really difficult code. Could you help me break it? What does that mean? Really? Yeah. And? To improve a certain technique? <sighs> I don't know how to take that. Why is that? Yeah. Sorry. I might have done something you don't like. <laughs> Congratulations on winning the stage. Are you a fan? I guess I don't know how important rugby is here. What's it like dating a local celebrity? I heard you were checking out the waterfall. Why? I don't know. My friend almost died. If you had anything to do with it. What were you doing near the bridge before it collapsed? Just visiting George. Are you sure? What's that? Is that a no? Do you believe in aliens? Just go easy on Bess. Could not care less. Oh, thanks for the notice, I guess. Okay, why? Got it. Thanks. Uh, well, it's been fun, I guess. How do I know when you're being who you really are? You have a vulnerable side? <laughs> right. Seems like you've been pretty nasty in the past competitions. George thinks I'll regret trusting you. Well, everyone is special in different ways. <laughs> Sorry, you know what I mean. You're smart and talented. Why did you dedicate your life to being on trashy TV? TV gave you a way to win? And this is what led you to TV? What? Okay, I'm ready to work with you. <laughs> it's different. No. Yes. Well, mentally. You've been keeping tabs on all of the competitors, haven't you? Huh? Okay, what have you noticed? Have you noticed anything odd about Sonny? Yeah, I guess that is what I'm asking. What was he saying? Why? You've done a lot of reality television. What do you think about Patrick? I found out more about your past. It seems you have a reputation for being a little cutthroat. It's hard not to. So reality television was the next logical step? You sure it's not sarcasm? As someone who grew up in New Zealand, do you think you have an unfair advantage? What happened back in the mines? Are you okay? Did you take my medallion piece? Should we leave the show? But that's not new. It must have been something specific. You and Sonny were fighting. Why? Could you? So what's your deal? I can't tell where you really stand. At this point, is this almost like a job for you? Nice job winning your stage. Bess is joining me. Are you going home? I heard she tried to save George. Thanks. Looks like she's going to be okay. Hey, Bess is great. What? Huh, haven't heard of it. How did you get started in reality television? What do you think Sunny is trying to do with the competition? All right, how's this? The password to the Stage 5 location is Waitomo. Any breakthroughs in the competition? Okay, how's this? The password to the Cromwell location is Otago Mines. Any breakthroughs in the competition? Thanks. Um, how's this? The password to the hatch is Doubtful Sound. The spirit of cooperation. Any breakthroughs in the competition? All right, I'm a little interested in the comics. Well, most things. I'm interested in everything. Not that I think. 
Have you found any comics lying around? They seem related to Sunny. What hits you? Why did you stop? Oh, yeah. I can't say I know what that means. What did you do before reality TV? Yeah, but at the same time, shows like this have so many safety regulations. Either way, she really couldn't tell. What makes you so sure it's a man? George thinks she saw someone cutting the bridge. Well, that's surprising, but I suppose I might be open to the thought of working together. You have an agent? Right, but at the end there can only be one winner. So what's the overall plan? I'm listening. For real? What do you mean? Can you prove that? Where were you right before the bridge collapsed? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I just need you to tell me something. What? This is not a joke. We could die down here. Whatever you're upset about, we can talk it through. You won't get away with this. What does? I just want you to think through what you're doing. There are other ways to get what you want. <sighs> Which can come in handy when you're looking for hidden artifacts. What? So, Kiri turned on us. You think the remaining contestants each have a role to play? Yeah? How so? I'm not looking to cheat. I think I need your help researching. Can you do that? Right. Lena knew Sonny's grandfather. <sighs> I'm gonna go. I'm still not making any progress with who cut the bridge. Any good advice on where to look for the plants? And... Okay, why? I know, but I'm not sure where to start. Should I trust Kiri? I don't know. How so? Kiri thinks Sonny hijacked the show. A little. So I just have to go to the television over there to hear them? I'm sorry you don't get to compete. I know how much you were looking forward to it. And we'll find out what happened with the bridge. I'm so glad you're okay. No matter what, we're going to win for you. Bess has volunteered to help. Well, I do like bending rules. Are you proposing I cheat? Yes, aside from what it means. Bess says that's my bonus quest from Sunny. What does turtle mean? Sure, why? I keep finding these comics. Keep working on it. Maybe it'll explain what he's up to. Now that is interesting. Has Sunny been visiting you? Search for plants first, win second. Then gloating, if time permits. Ready for this? George! What is it? Is something wrong? It looks pretty dangerous. You sure you want to do this? Did we win? Bess, catch! It's locked. It's in my nature, like it's in yours to believe. It almost makes me not want to know where the story ends and the truth begins. So, if the artifact is here, what exactly does that mean? What is it doing? Got it! I hope for Lena's sake he doesn't get caught up in a rip current. He might just kick back and see where it takes him. After putting his superior sinking skills to work, Patrick has decided to conquer his greatest fear. Sadly, it won't be the last we hear from her. Her newest show, Detained Diva, The Kiri Redemption, is set to air this fall. After a quick call to her agent, Kiri confessed. Once the real production crew arrived, Best George and I worked with the show's editor and finally found the evidence of who cut the rope bridge. After George was injured, Best stepped up and did her best to help us take home the trophy. Okay, just kidding. You are now dating a reality show winner. Go Team Tui! Love, Nancy. So bye. <laughs> Love, Nancy. Can't wait to see you. After talking to some former contestants, I guess our experience was pretty much exactly how it goes every time. That's my story of being on reality TV. I don't actually know. I fell asleep trying to keep track. Guess how many counting sheep jokes Bess made. George was soon well enough to move around a bit and got to join us on an exciting tour of New Zealand, although she had a tough time keeping her eyes open. Winning the contest was just what Bess needed. She's back to being the best we all know and making friends right and left. I'm running away now. Please don't tell anyone which way I went. No, wait. The last thing he said was, I can't argue with that. I have no idea how to argue with that. Dear Ned, I'm not allowed to tell you what happened at Pacific Run until the episode airs. Imagine the word what, wearing a cape and riding a flaming motorcycle off a cliff. That's the way to live. I'm guessing he found it, since his parting advice to me was, he was searching for a reason to follow Jin's lead. But after his time in New Zealand, I do know he believes in Jin. I don't know if Sonny believes everything Spide teaches. 
To my surprise, he said he didn't know. I asked him if he really believes the artifact was placed by aliens. Sunny, I think, is more interested in following where it leads. Jamila is coordinating with museums in New Zealand to study the artifact we found. Sunny sent Lena a few of Jin's books as a thank you for her help. For her, an unsolvable code might just be the greatest gift there is. What? You pushed me in. Why did you bring us all here? Well, everyone has off days. I know, but talk to him. Patrick, I need you to figure him out. Is everything okay? You seem to be having a hard time. That's great. I've got something you can knock out of the park. Bess, snap out of it. Bess, fine. You might get hurt. That doesn't mean something bad is going to happen to you. I know you're upset, but everything will be fine. Whoa, you look worried. Honestly, whatever happens, I've got your back. Well, how so? You've had a rough time since you've been here. It's a blip on the radar. Consider it done. Why are you so into winning the contest? We will win. If you want to win, it will. But in the meantime, it will come to you. I don't know if I understand. We're not quite there yet. Maybe it'll go better next time. Oh, <laughs> that's not the best I know. So, how did you and your wiles do with Sunny? You won the task? I need you to look into everywhere we've seen Sunny before. Not sure. Uh, sculpture? Sure, we're talking about something else. Okay. Okay, go see if you can pry any information out of him. See something interesting? Do you want to maybe put that Sunny enthusiasm to work? Bess! 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 Those aren't limited to Italy. Pretty much anyone who... Okay, I get it. That'd be nice. I don't know if we have time for that. Yes! No, mainly she's still interested in Sunny. Jamila? <laughs> what do you mean? She thinks Sunny has brought us together to help him contact aliens. Do you want to hear what she said? Ah, <laughs> I need more information than that. I guess not. In what way? So, Patrick is a cow. Great. How did it go with Patrick? Yeah? Is this normal best speaking or pining for Sunny Bess? Why does anyone put up with anyone? That is reasonable. I've got your back. Okay, what's that? Did you find anything out about Kiri? Yeah, so... Powers? Calling it an island might be a bit dismissive. Go ahead. <laughs> you want to explain that sound? Hmm, yeah, maybe I should try. How did round two go with Sunny? I need your help distracting Patrick. I gathered something like that. He's a person and also alive. <laughs> yeah? Thanks for distracting Patrick. If Sonny brought her here because she cracks codes, then maybe he needs help. But in summary, I have no idea. You may blame me, but I blame Sonny. You mean Lena helping us out? All right, thanks. Hopefully Lena cracked that code. Did you find a points card? I need you to find a points card for Lena. You can go to the Puzzle Palace and try to boost our score. <laughs> you sure? How so? If we get caught, we're on the same page. I know, right? What? Is something bugging you? What? Bess, is that you? That's fine. You've earned it. Bye-bye. Talk to you later. I'll let you go. Goodbye. Later. Looks like I need to assemble all of the pieces first. Let me guess, those lights were the good news. We're stuck, aren't we? Looks like I'll have to repair this. I guess that's as high as it goes. It's already too low. I need to find something to help me understand these symbols first. Maybe this will help explain the plan Sunny accidentally mentioned. If I use Jin's comic and the notebook, I should be able to spin the rings to the correct alignment and unlock all of the pins. Sonny's somewhere in here. I should find him first. Looks like this will be a challenge later on. I bet I need to fill in the rest of the board so that none of the pieces touch a piece of the same color. I need to figure out what this is before I mess with it. Hmm, the shearing motor must be jammed. I'd better figure out the combination first. Knowing Sunny, I'd better figure out the combination before messing with that. I need to match that image in order to charge the claw. I'd better figure out what I'm supposed to do here first. If I can light all of the grid sections, I might be able to get the power back on. 
Whoa, I'm going to need a professional to crack this. It's locked. There must be a way to block the camera's sight lines. Need to earn more points first. I can't go below 50. I have to keep 50 points in reserve. I don't have enough points. I'd better give this to Lena. Needs a charge. I'll have to charge it first. Looks like it needs a charge. Sunny was here, and now my medallion isn't. This must be the show's confession booth. Hmm. Nah, I'll just stick with talking to myself. I'll need to turn the power on first. Let's see if I can find all the words. I only get to call one contact. Not sure if I'm ready to choose yet. The fish figurine goes here. Jamila, 020-496-0423. Sunny's focusing on a small group of us. Why? That's the last one. Time to head in. Looks like I can use our points to buy things. Sounds good, Bess. Looks like someone got here first. Where's my medallion? I need to find and fill in the symbol listed. Can't do that yet. All right, I did it. Looks like I'll need something to activate that. Under nest in tree? Hmm, I'll have to check that out. These arrows look just like what I saw on Lena's clipboard. I need to find a bag for the wool first. Looks like I can tie a rope off here. Now to figure out what the comic meant. So Jin is Sunny's grandfather. Is this why Sunny's here? Okay, so let's see if I can figure out Jamila's instructions. What's this? Interesting. Yeah, I'm going to have to figure out what's inside of this. I'm not allowed back there, at least not while the security cameras are active. That's not a good idea. I can't do that now. Can't go in there now. Time to get this sand in the water and pan for gold. Hmm, maybe I should add something. I think I have enough dirt to start. All right, dirt. Time to find a sluice. Uh-oh, need to get back in, and fast. Looks like I'll need a password. Cool, I wonder what's down there. Pacao, I have picked thou. Yes, what else would you expect from the fastest paddle in the West? Time to race. Need to find a way to unlock this hatch. This looks like some sort of code. I was born to kayak, but which boat is the one for me? This doesn't look like it's part of the competition. Hmm, that's the last one. Time to head in. Hmm, I wonder what this means. It's about time I got to pilot a sub. <sighs> it's too dark. I need to get a fire going to see what's on that wall. I need to place all the ships in the grid according to the numbers. What is this? Is this one of the relics Sunny's looking for? This puzzle is a tad bit insensitive considering... Hmm, I think I need more information to crack this code. Interesting. Looks like I could open this if I found the right key. This looks like the spot from the comic. I should investigate. Found you, Jock Stewart. <laughs> now to bring you home. I need to label the sheep correctly according to their breeds and the farmer name. I need to get the totals to add up to 20. Did it! I need to get all of the blades flat. This must be where the bag of wool needs to go. I need a key to get this working. The blades on the shearing machine need to be replaced. I can handle that. This must be the sheep to shear. I need to get the shearing machine powered on and working. Yes, now to place this on the stand at base camp. This looks like a good place to dig for gold. This must be what Kiri was after. Wait a second. Whoa, I bet this spells something out. There's gold in that there pan. Ha! <laughs> Better take it. I need all the panning supplies first. Let's find some gold. Looks like each opening needs a complete fan in order to get the sluice working. This can't be part of the game. What is Sunny up to? <laughs> nice. Whoa, what is going on here? Is Sunny on some sort of mission? There's a key in there. Let's see if I can light this lantern. All right, I did it. I should figure out what these letters spell. I need to find all of the differences. All done. Doubtful sound. That must be the password to the hatch. Looks like she's keeping tabs on the competition. Whoa! I'm not sure what else I expected. Hmm, I need to keep an eye on this. It looks important. One medallion down. Go Team Tui! I need to put the plants in the correct vases. This looks useful. Time to get these tracks together. Because who cares? Ha! What? Oh, why do I have different colored shoes on? 
When you live to be my age, you start to realize that most reality TV shows have predetermined endings. But at the same time, I don't particularly care. Oh, I would of course like to win. It'd be just wonderful. I feel like we had more interesting conversations when I was a boy. Granddad, he says, I don't have time for commercials. I love to stream things. And I love my very long skateboard. Now is this going to be on streaming? My grandson loves streaming. I'm 86 years young, and I'm just tickled to be on the show. Television. D does anyone need a personal chef? I'm really good. Ruin my life! And I'll say, oh, it was super fun, and I just didn't... I have to fly home to my family now, and they'll say, how, how did it go? Why, me, we didn't even make the first round! <laughs> it was a risk, but I'm very confident we'll win. I quit my job to come here. My name is Olivia. I am a former personal chef. Rarely, but on those rare days. I can't really disclose most of my work. My resume is almost entirely acronyms at this point. Lots of freelance work in the information sector. Here. I'm here to win. Oh, girl. Oh, girl. I haven't decided yet. And stay out of my things. It was a test. I hit a lot of medallions and left a lot of codes behind. Hey, I know how you found the medallion. Nah, I'm good. Interesting. I can't. Yes? How did you know? At night, show me a person falling down and give me some popcorn. Oh, please with that. I spend my day being smart. I'm a Pacific Run super fan. I've watched all the seasons multiple times. A man. I'm bored. This is boring. Swim burger. Richard. Three, hands down. Who would lie about loving reality TV? <laughs> Good luck out there, Tiger. Welcome to the playing field. In the case of a direct tie, what are the five possible tiebreak activities? Oh, yeah? Just let me read it. I promise you'll get it back. Let me see it. You have that? Yeah, I believe it. And so far the tests, I don't believe anything. I take evidence and I test it. It simply said, I know you understood. Sorry, I was bad at the trumpet. Until one day I got a note. No, I never heard from him again. Ran off. He took it. These artifacts, it seemed. I could understand it. It was amazing. It had all of these rare codices, like the emerald tablet, but he dropped a book. When I cornered him, so I followed him. I noticed him sneak out of a rehearsal. Will you or won't you? It just is. Remove. I moved the medallion only once. Players may not remove the medallions of the opposing team. Paragraph titled medallions third line down. And I did. Yes, take it up with the producer if you'd like. I'm looking for numbers in an empty set. I need to leave him. Oh no, this explains everything. Oh, this explains everything. Wait, that's it. Wait, no, I don't. Anyway, there's more than being smart. But when has something sharp ever felt like home? Yeah, Patrick may not be the sharpest knife in the drawer. The only way to win is not to play. There's no solution. That's fine. I'm not trying to sell you on my boyfriend. Don't get any ideas. Even he isn't aware of it sometimes. I know what you're getting at. He's got a depth most people don't see. Oh, I don't remember. He's more of the romantic one. Seems right. Um, a while? He'd just pretend. No, he brought an instrument, but he couldn't play. I work with an orchestra. It's one of my hobbies. I caught him sneaking in, but I couldn't tease out why. The pool shared a hallway with a rare book room. When life hands you an adorable old man pretending to play trumpet, you enjoy it. Patrick loves to come here as often as he can. We make time. I've got an apartment in D.C., but mainly we travel. Yes, I do. Yeah, the whole camp heard. She's lucky to be alive. You want a free tip? Did you not read the rules? No player shall remove a medallion in the course of an active competition segment. Section 2, middle paragraph. Hmm, right. Ten bucks says you'll never read the rules. Winners see rules as a direct path to winning. Losers see rules as limitations. Read the rules. Here's how you win anything. Only when it doesn't matter. I'm just giving myself enough room to decide a path later. But I also like winning. In part, I really do like a fair fight. Me too. Well done. I'll toast your closing of a loophole with the opening of a new loophole. You talk to Sunny. Do yourself a favor and read the rules. As long as you're asking as a competitor. No, you should definitely do that. I suppose you could form an alliance with a pack of wild dogs. Smart. She's the tricky type. So you paired up with Kiri. Just let me read it. I promise you'll get it back. Let me see it. 
You have that? No. It's a type of musical composition. It's intended to teach a skill. He said, this is my etude. Yes. When I caught him sneaking into the rare book room, I asked him why. About Sonny's grandfather? There's something I remember. Hey, but then, Sonny exists. I just assumed that was some inscrutable old man joke. He said, no, it's better than that. Sonny will tell you. I suppose mine is chasing off old fakers. Right. I was more amused than anything, so I said, Hey there, how goes it? Nancy, you'll need a lot more of these to stay afloat. Your teammate has expensive tastes. Well, I'm sorry for you. The deduct card. I'm sure you'll turn it around. Thanks. Sorry things didn't go your way. Used to be, but then my favorite player retired. Some people have other hobbies, but that's the official lowdown. Eating, sleeping, rugby. You don't need to add that local modifier. Okay, bye. See you later. Bye. Did you see it or hear about it? Either way, I have to go. Neither did Patrick. I didn't hurt your friend. You'll what? I was looking for a fern like we were supposed to. If you do me a favor. For now. So I'll let it slide. That might be true. What are you after? What's the game? I saw you in the out-of-bounds area. See how he reacts. Don't tell him it came from me. Ask Sonny if this means anything to him. If you have to ask, the answer is no. Next question. And if he's the right guy, it'll work out. And if he's not, he gets to enjoy some good standing. That's his mission. We'll see. I told him to pick a spot that felt right and stand there when he feels like it. I know, the river thing was my clue that he was the one. My grandfather always looks for men and women who follow the current of fate. Yeah, he's brilliant. He's near perfect. The mystic. We can destroy each other. Why do you say that? You and me, we're the same. That's not true. You're lying. You're not even supposed to be here. I don't know what you're talking about. No one else got this mission, just me. Why? I promise I had no idea. What was that about? Tell the odds my way will stay cool. That's dramatic. It's unnatural. It's not wrong. You're afraid. You're just afraid. So what if I am? I'm not doing it. It's wrong. Yes, you are. I'm not scared. You can't just back away from this because you're scared. Hey, just out of curiosity, what do you think of Sunny? Anyway, what's I'm saying? Wanna crack him? How are things? I'm right. Am I right? That's a great rock. Oh, hello. These crackers are really good. Have a cracker. Your company's great. I not that I'm not enjoying you. Well, that's good. I was worried. Yeah. What's up, my man? Do you talk to other people? You like to talk. Um, forgot. Um, yes. Please. All right, these are great. Oh, crackers. Thanks. What's your... So, hey. Yeah. So you like this sunny fellow, huh? Another wonderful brick wall impression, Lena. I'm not a villain. I just want to win. Your background is a bit top secret. Why is that? There you have it. Not a smart move, but I'll let it happen. Nancy teaming up with Kiri. Oh, at this point, we've given up trying to keep this season on the rails. Make sure he sees this, okay? For you to risk Everything must be very valuable. You're here to find that artifact? I cracked that code of yours. Yo, Sonny, nothing wrong with that. You seem a little overqualified to be here. I was supposed to be there for the contest, but not my fault. That poor girl got hurt. Leave it be. I'm not talking about that bridge. He does need something. Is motivation the right word? Patrick just needs motivation. Do you normally yell at your boyfriends? All right, Slate. Proposal, Amy. Amy, baby, I did this for you. Will you make me the happiest man on TV? Okay, once more if I decide to head in a different direction. All right, Slate, Proposal, Sheila. Sheila, baby, I did this for you. Will you make me the happiest man on TV? Great, BTW, if I win, can we play this proposal? Slate, devastated, I can't even talk. All right, Slate, confidence, general, I own it, everything. All right, Slate, betrayal, pending, my own. Look up, those aren't stars, that's bus. I put you there. Slate, betrayal, generic female. I can't believe she threw me under the bus. All right, uh, Slate, betrayal, generic male. I can't believe he threw me under the bus. You're already rolling? Then let's go. Let's just bang these out. I'm going to run and gun here and start tape. Look, I can't be popping in here. I need to be on my game, so, uh... Oh, sure thing. Excellent. Do you mind if I play it a bit different for the camera? 
I am dissolving this partnership. You are no longer needed. It's been fun, but I'm turning against you now. Fair warning. Things will be different next time we talk. Intuition. If you like that, step back. Nancy, I'm a caricature when I'm in front of the camera. It's an act. And this season, I'll throw them for a loop, letting them see my friendly, vulnerable side. Time will tell. Very few people are special. No, everyone's different. I was raised to believe I was, and so were all my classmates. No, <laughs> I'm not talented. Pfft, talent. You play it fast and loose with the judgments, don't you? I'm a greyhound. Fame is a cruel sport. But I have a need to run. Something to burn off the energy. It gave me something where it didn't matter either way. Just not the talent. Just a lifetime of coming in second. I've got the drive and all that business. Not good enough. Modern darts? I was good. This is what got me up every day at four to take the bus into the city as a kid. You'll regret something else. You won't regret this. Yes, you are. And you're upset that I keep notes longhand while you keep them in your head. So you found my notes. Have you not been doing that? Mm-hmm. In a sad, terrifying, this is foreshadowing way. Yeah, but not in a cute way. What really got me was the talking to the animals. But I grew accustomed to that. The talking to no one was disturbing at first. Other than the fact that he's taken the show hostage? Yes. It was mostly apologies. What was the content of his human-to-animal communication? So, I used TV to fix that problem. I tried reality by itself, but no one pays you or pays attention to you. That's a true statement, assuming that will ever happen. Ask me again when he wakes up. But they only root for the team that competes the least. See, now that I don't get. People tune in to see a competition. But you're watching a competition. You root for the nice team, don't you? As good as any other. I like you. It's the national pastime. By the age of ten, every New Zealander knows how to find scattered medallion pieces. You know it. I really don't want to talk about it. The only thing I hate more than cheaters are people who turn a blind eye. I'll keep an eye out. I really didn't. <sighs> Guess it's only fair to ask everyone. And I am not starting today. I have never left a show early. We're speeding toward disaster. Can't you feel it? He's turned this show into a runaway train. Because he's out of his mind. Save it for the confessional, kid. I could say the same thing for you. Entirely. I made a smart choice teaming up with you, it seems. Thanks, Nancy. The blonde with the day glow camo. Good luck with that. No, going on alone. You? She did. Same with Aaron. I'm so sorry about George. As much as I love trash talk, that's all it is. Nancy, I'm teasing you. At the end of the day, this is a game. How's it going? Hi. All right. And that reality became my reality. But I met the producer of the show and we hit it off. Later, in a boat thing. Unrelated. We went skiing, he died. Basically, you'd go on a date after staying up for 24 hours straight. A dating show called Sleepless. Sunny be crazy. That's my best guess. Fly it into orbit? Here, this should help. Now that is useful. So far, things have been pretty one-sided. Why would I tell you about that? Name 50. Oh, no, you're not. But you're interested in them. No, why? Is that a bonus? Hmm. Why? One day, you put on the spandex and the mirror glass-coated antlers and it hits you. I did that. Never made the poster, but always made rent. Eventually. Ish. You know those arty French circuses? This, that... Aerial arts paid the bills. The next day, I saw myself as absurd. So I quit. The day before, I saw myself as an artist. It's sort of a specific feeling. Hey, come over here. Later. Bye. But don't forget that regulations matter less when the producer's a lunatic. Regulations, sure. Any chance it's just her imagination? A working knowledge of history and humanity. Did she see what he looked like? Yep. Yes, MacLeod. But I don't need to win. I need to stay around long enough to get screen time. I promised my age and I'd make it to the finals. You and I should form an alliance. For real, yes. Apparently, he trashed the travel paperwork for the actual crew. I have a proposal for you. I heard a conference call. He's not supposed to be the one running the show. Sunny June, the producer. Good. Here's something. Consider it a show of good faith. Maybe Sunny can? In the confessional booth. Lest you want to roll on out. You best stroll on out. I am Queen Kiri, and this is my court. I know who I am. Who do you think you are? This is my house, this is my country, and I'm going to win. Kiri, I think you better say it again, because it sounded like you just said you need me to tell you something. What did you just say to me? That's not a remote possibility. 
if you die down there or something. But, worst case scenario, you'll be fine. Fine, I'll skip to the punchline. Want to hear a funny story? Probably less well for you. See, that's what I'm going to say. And it's going to work out perfectly for me. The cave was dangerous? I thought it was part of the show. Making you pay for your betrayal. But feelings don't steer this ship, honey. No, you want me to feel differently. I played you from word one. You think you can psychoanalyze me? It'll be as much his fault as mine. When you die down there... Hi, Kiri. Oh, hi, Sonny. Yeah, you too. Do not get caught. Get out. Just give it to me. That's not good enough. Do you have it? You're late. Nancy is not good at playing along. Seems Nancy may not be all that intimidated by your new persona. A word of warning, fellow contestants, you won't hear until it's too late. Then I strike. A portion of pity to drop the defenses. Whatever's clever. I'm misunderstood. Like, I don't belong. Step one. I make up a sad story. Here's how Kiri does what Kiri does. You seem to have the manipulation angle down. Perhaps help will come as soon as we convince local authorities that we're not prank callers. A desperate plea for help from a woman who clearly doesn't understand remote recording technology. He's using us. He brought me here because of what I used to do. Now he's after something. Wanted me to go down into the mines to win some bonus? The producer gave me this map or whatever. I need you to get me out of here. The mood grows grim for Kiri, showing why she's our editor's favorite. A stunning display of efficiency from Kiri. Of course I cheat. There have been some allegations. That know-it-all past question-asking Rue better get right out or I'll set her right. Nancy Drew, you just woke up a cave full of dragons, girl. Any words for the competition? Wouldn't that be something now? But if I did, I'm not saying I cut the bridge. Isn't that a touch suspicious? You don't seem that upset about losing your teammate. Well, best of luck, Kiri, and anyone foolish enough to stand in her way. An update from the unhinged as Kiri starts to unravel, going as far as to threaten the show's producer. And I will beat you at your own game. I will figure out what you're up to. You are insane. Sonny, do you watch these? Let's leave Kiri to her thoughts of teasing fish in a barrel. Still, it's not even worth it. It's so easy to mess with Bess. Any insights about your fellow contestants you'd like to share? And in sleep, what endorsement deals may come? That's the dream, right? I just want to hold a lasagna up to the camera and smile about money. That when Famous actually writes their own book. My own line of ghost-written cookbooks? K, a sensation of elegance. I want my own fragrance line? There are lots of things I want. What brought you back to reality TV? You don't even know what note I was going for. I'm just that good. Hey! Yeah! Listen to this. I oversoul like no one on this earth. I am going to win because I am an amazing singer. Low? Low? So I can yell at you to your face, that's why. What do you mean that's a different show? Why are you talking to me on this earpiece? You better show yourself. What? That's the point of this show, right? What do you mean, other skills? Hmm. 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 Maybe that's why she's here. I know! Get into an impossibly small space no one else could reach? I mean, it's not like we need to... Who needs some weird French circus contortionist? Eh. It's like he knew who'd be left. He needs us for something. Didn't you notice how weak the competition was up front? You're the detective. Sonny keeps chatting with me about this device. I think I'm the one who is good at machines, in the comic. My theory might be right. I know. I started. Check my tablet for updates. I have a hard time staying. <laughs> but you want the goods on everyone who's here. Nancy! I'm scandalized. It could get us kicked off the show. I'll look into it. Whoa! That's not a coincidence. That's really good. Sorry, I'm just a little sleep. Okay, I'm awake. I'm awake. Ooh. You do the footwork, and I'll research where they might be. All right, let's start looking for those plants. I'm working on it. You do your thing. There's something puzzling about him. I've been listening to the show audio, and it seems good for her. 
Keep sending Bess to talk to Patrick. Read everything you can find. Search his tent. Nancy, you need to look into Sunny. I'll look into her history. Should we be worried? Why are we focused on this one area? And normally you travel the whole Pacific, hence the name. I mean, first the crew is non-existent. Well, you know I'm a huge Pacific Run fan, and I can tell you that this season is way off. That would make sense. All right. Just in case you need to sneak back and catch up. Yeah, and hey, take this. I'll get to watch, at least. Which reminds me, I have a producer feed. Okay, that might be nice. That's sweet of you, but you don't need to. Bess? Bess Marvin. I know you do. Are you sure you want to help? This is a lot to do alone. No, just... Something odd is going on here. We might need to bend the rules. It's a key to the producer area. Just don't get caught. Bye. See you later. Aha. Um, you might want to check with him on that. Aside from what it means. What's up? Hi. Hey there. It's like he's been getting impatient. Well, he keeps asking about my sleuth friend and what she's up to. You need to ask Sunny about the clues you've been finding. I think Sunny wants you to read them. Come back. Just don't get caught. Bye. See you later. Can't talk. Call me if you need anything. Catch up with me later. Sorry, still making a plan. Got it. Or review blueprints. I guess it's confusing. Yes, um, Nancy. He wants me to help him build a machine. Sounds good. What should we do first? You know it. What's up? <coughs> yes, uh, more than I've wanted to do anything. All right, rope bridge. Did you notice that Sunny's only focusing on some of the teams? There's more than a competition here, but still, I'd like to win. And apparently, very excited about signing my cast. I was pretty scrambled after the accident. It'll be a miracle if you survive. You are in serious trouble. Really, good luck. So, good luck, contestants. It's his show to run until things settle down. And while we're sending a team to step in, it appears he's hijacked the show to suit his own bizarre goals. We've lost control of this production to producer Sunny June. At Pacific Run, we rarely air our dirty laundry, but desperate times call for ratings grabbing details. So we're good. And a sweeps week miracle if you don't. What? How is there possibly more? That means sudden death. And it's a tie. Let's tally the score. Wait. Carrie's gonna win. Yeah, you better run. Time to unveil the final test. You cheated! And Sunny June will never work in this town again. Team Tui's upset will go down in Pacific Run history. Two things are certain. As Nancy Drew lets no obstacle stand in her way. There you have it. A surprise come from behind victory for Team Tui. Congratulations to Curie. Pacific Run New Zealand to emerge the winner of this season of But in the end, Team Tawaki pushes through Valiant team effort by Team Tui. Dare to play. I don't understand any of this. Then why ask? There's always a piece of truth in his stories. It's real. I'll be honest, this part was a surprise. Pass under a group of stalactites, not the fang kind. Are you sure you wouldn't rather focus on the rafting? Pass under the Minotaur's horns! No wait! Horns! Pass under the Minotaur's hands! Aim for the lightning bolt looking thing! Avoid the thing that looks like, uh, giant fangs! I'm not smart like you! Nancy, you don't get it! This is all I have to offer! What if this is my new life? I don't even know how to hold a conversation for a minute! I get tongue-tied around Sunny! I can't make friends! Everything is wrong! I'll do my best! I don't know if that is possible. Name it. Just one thing. I just need to do something well. I know, I'm trying. Then what? And if that goes away, that's it. I'm fun. I'm not sporty like George. Don't use your logic voice on me if you're not going to use your logic... logic. You do know that George is the cautious, capable one. I look worried. Please go back to lying to me. 
I'm honestly, genuinely happy for both of you. So have you. I mean, that's great. George has had all of these opportunities. It's been longer than that. I need to prove I can do something right. Because nothing is going well for me. I do. It's silly, but I do. What if it doesn't? Shouldn't I have some big life plan? Everybody else does. Me neither. I just don't know what I want. Let's go win more things! I want to win everything. I see the appeal of this stuff now. I can't believe we're winning! I will try again. The Marvin Mojo is legendary. New Zealand is doing something weird to me. I'm off my game. And I just repeated it back, but louder. He said, can I help you? Nancy, that has never happened. I froze, just trying to be an optimist. I'm sorry, Nancy, I really thought I could do it. Nope, good news. I'm on it. A barista. He's like one of those tall, beautiful things they have in Italy. I just want to look at him. Pretend I'm talking to you about something, but I'm not. I'm sorry. I'm looking at Sonny. I'll bust out my feminine wiles. You know I do. Yes, what? Bass, what? Shh! I can almost picture him with a puppy, and it's perfect. Yes, yes, keep saying words. If you stand between me and this prize, you will rue the day. This is non-negotiable. A high five is nice. A present is nice. The prize is a hot shower followed by snacks. We're taking the side quest. I'm on edge here. I need this. Okay. Do you? Do you? Hello. No need to use our one call wisely. That's fine. So, is she a New Zealand expert now? Who did you call? You look guilty. Nancy? Well, that is odd. Actually, yes, but can I still be angry? You really made a good choice there. There's so little of it. I mean, how hard can it be to learn about an entire country? Dave dragged me to the fair, remember him? It's like that time I met a cow. He's so calm, I forget myself. Does it matter? That man is an enigma, and the not super smart part of cows. Just the profound part of cows, and smelling, let's be honest. Just being, not thinking, not wanting anything. I think I was there for like hours. We got into not a staring contest, more of a staring cooperation. And we had a really long cow slash human moment. And she was looking at me, but then I found myself looking at a cow. It was a fair, you know, so animals, scam artists, flirting with food poisoning, watching my inbox, even though I know he doesn't have my email. It's just me, tragic Bess. Normal Bess is dead. Because eating alone is sad? Why does Patrick put up with her? I am terrified of Lena. And someone to concentrate on my feelings. She said some really mean things. Great. Now I just need someone who has my front and sides and a dedicated person for my head. And she's after me right now, so it might get six kind of serious tonight. And she's fast. She is not a fan of people reading her texts. Yes, I did. Sorry. So what if I call them powers? Read a book once in a while. Oh, please. We all have skills. My powers are useless here. Something is weird about this island. Later. Nope. But I do want to make it again. <sighs> like I needed to go look at a tree. I just walked right on past him. That's where his powers come from. Good luck. Don't look directly in his eyes. Got it. What's up? Nancy! Do you know that his parents and their parents going back were some sort of mystical teachers? He's so... Calm. I know, but he's like my spirit animal. I actually like doing it. We had crackers. I stood next to him and we didn't say anything, but it's like he wouldn't talk about it. What do you think it means? I only ask because you have thrown my barometer way off. This is weird, yes? Yes, I did. Consider it done. Is there anything I can help with? I would rather not. Sorry, but that sounds awful. Is there anything I should be doing? Positive. Whatever the next challenge is, I'm going to master it. I think it's time for me to prove myself. Get out of here, you old so-and-so. Goodbye. Bye. Good. 
But if we get caught in his tent, we'll be kicked out. We've got to see what he's up to. Sonny, there's something about him I can't figure out. Yeah, yeah I'm sure this will end well for all involved. Saving the day, that's what. Guess what I'm doing, Nancy? Nancy! Okay, here's the rope. I just want to enjoy it for a second. Listen, I know you want to escape right away, but I've never saved the day. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Team Tui's best Marvin. Not on trial. Yes, thank you. I do. Do you understand that words are typically used to clarify or explain ideas? I'm pretty good at people things. Now you are. So just name one skill. I wasn't exactly prepared. I trust you're more ready now. Let's not have a repeat of last time. I'm not on trial here. Why are you being so evasive? Why are you being like this? Too bad about that. It's not in the stars, so to speak. You're clearly infatuated with Sonny. That's not something I have to do often. Could you list those skills? I have skills. We've noticed a lack of any special skills in your application. This never happened. All right, then. Um, what? Do you have a girlfriend? You seem like the strong, silent type. I'm going to die here. End it. Make it quick. Please, someone throw me under the bus. It's a visceral expression of human joy and loss and love, and I truly respect the form. Reality television is much maligned, but I maintain it is the height of the art. I consider myself a student of the medium. Why am I here? <laughs> so much ocean and just water. There's nowhere to go but New Zealand. I mean, I look at the map and I start to panic. Why is New Zealand so far away from everything? I'm just going to go home. Is that okay? Can I make a call? I can. I've made a huge mistake. We should all be scared of it. Truthfully, I am scared of it. I lied to the camera each time I pretended that I wasn't scared of it. Also, I hate Krollmeister brand self-spreading butter. Well, I lost and will now admit that I was lying.